go. Talk to St. Thomas head basketball coach John Tower. You threw the ball out of bounds. That can't happen. For just a moment. Realizing I'm in a not a great situation. Let me turn it into a decent situation. You realize he's a pretty smart guy. Day after day, get a little bit better. Aristotle, excellence is not an act, but a habit. He's also been quite successful. Last week, according to the school, Tower became the second fastest Division III coach ever to 200 wins. Good luck. In just 246 games. Hey, easy play. We always say coaches get too much credit and too much blame depending on wins and losses. It's a reflection of all the players, all the coaches, collective efforts. His success has spanned nine years, but Tower insists wins were never his goal. I think the milestones are things that they're fun to talk about for other people, but it just, you know, at the end of the day, it, it doesn't change one thing about how we coach to that day or how we'll coach moving forward. If Tower's methods seem a little cerebral, it's because he literally wrote the book on kids and parents in sports. He's also a psychology professor here at St. Thomas, and he has gotten a reputation of being able to motivate and draw the best out of his players. We'll be, he'll be talking about stuff, and now that I've gone through like three and a half years of it, I'll be able to like be like, oh, this is from that study, this is from that study, and kind of like relate with them better than I could freshman year. Box out, Will. Coaching their minds just as much as their bodies, Towers created players that live for their team. Good look, Kevin. Rather themselves. Come on. When he was recruiting me, I mean, one of the main pitches was, you know, like, you're a great player in high school and we see what you can do, but when we get good players to come here, we don't have anybody that scores 20 a game. You know, we have three, four guys that score double figures a game, but we win the conference championship almost every year. And they have, finishing first in the MIAC every year. Tower's been the head coach at St. Thomas, but his players think after 200 wins, the best is yet to come. 200's great, but I expect to see him around for 300, 400, 500. In St. Paul, Dave Schwartz, Care 11 Sports. St. Thomas number four, St. John's number two, and that clash happens this month. Back after this.